hi guys welcome back to my channel Rosamel's world signing in i'm so glad to have you and in today's vlog i'll be taking you along as i prepare some mashed potatoes and some cola bacon for sure we are going to be elevating this dish and i can't wait to take you along welcome to start off the cooking i have added my potatoes in my cooking pot i will add some water and leave my potatoes to boil I have added my water and some salt to taste and I'm going to cover it up and leave it to cook. As my potatoes cook, I will chop my bacon into tiny bits and then fry it. I have already added the bacon into my pan, put it into small bits and I'm going to fry it until it's crispy. Here's the bacon, I have already chopped it into small bits and I want to fry it. And by the way, I don't know if I'm the only person who finds bacon very oily. So to start off, I've not added any oil to the pan, but rather I've added some water. And once the water has evaporated, I will allow the bacon to cook by itself until it's crispy. So this is how my potatoes are looking, they are fully cooked, I have not disturbed them. I will drain off the excess water then we will start mashing them. So these are the results after I have drained off the excess water. I will add the bacon, the crispy bacon, here it is. And guys don't be deceived, I have used the whole 100 grams of bacon but it has shrunk after I have fried it. So I am going to add it to the potatoes. I'm also going to add some butter and in this case I'm going to use some blue butter. If you're going to cook this recipe, you can use any kind of butter that you have. And last but not least, I am going to add a bit of milk. Once I've done that, I am now going to begin mashing my potatoes too. So these are the final results of the mashed potatoes. And as you can see, I have bits of bacon all over my food. But maybe next time when I prepare this dish, I might decide to use a little bit more bacon so that we can have a bite of bacon in every bite. All the same, I've already tasted the dish and it is quite delicious. Very soft, but when you get to bite into a bacon, it turns out to be very crispy. We are going to enjoy this with some vegetables and some cucumber. So you can also try it and give me your comments and feedback once you try this dish.